How long have you been making enchiladas for? Uh, for about 30 years. And who taught you how to make them? My mama. First, we're going to clean the chile. You wash it, you rinse it. Take up the tails. And then you're going to put it to boil until it's tender. Minos, garlic powder, salt, and in a minute I'm going to slice some onions when it's almost done. And let it get brown. And how do you know when the chiles are ready? It's, it gets tender. Right now it's kind of hard. It's got to be real tender so it could blend better. The chile is almost done. So let's get the blender ready. You're going to throw some onions in there. Some salt. garlic. If you have a fresh garlic, it's better. If you don't, you can use powder. It's ready. Turn it off and let's rinse it. Remember to rinse it because the chile has a lot of dirt. Make sure it's nice and clean. You put water. you expect this chili to be? This is mild, so it's gonna, it's not gonna be that bad. What is this? This is lard. You put a little bit so you can fry your chili after you, uh, so we just dump it in. And you strained it? Yeah, it's, it's strained. It's all in there. Okay. And that's it. The rest you throw it away. See your chili is already boiling. So it's ready. You can get tortillas. And just like heat them up a little bit so they won't break. See how they blow a little bubble. That's when you're ready. And this is the main ingredient that makes it so delicious. We're going to get some lard, put them in the pan. Once it's melted, it's ready. So you get your tortilla, put it in the chile, and you put it in the lard. 
swear it's an inset. That way you can flip them. Make sure they're covered. Okay, get a little bit of meat. And put it in, in there. In the middle. Get your cheese. And you roll it. some top the cheeks and this my friend is how you top your enchiladas <laughs>